There is 600 hungry, hungry animals here in the rescue zoo, and today we are talking about food in the rescue, so let's just get started with today's Play Rescue episode. When feeding our 600 animals, we always need to take into account all the different dietary needs the animals may have. Some of them might be primarily vegetarians, others might need a mix of carbohydrates, proteins, fruits and veggies. And others might only eat protein, like our big cats. We even have some animals that can't eat specific kinds of food. <laughs> Alright Sarah, so I have heard that some of the primates, especially gibbons, yeah. maybe also some of the smaller mammoths, yeah. have some very special dietary needs. Yes. Like what are, what are some of the specific stuff you need to do to prep the food? Yeah, for some of the given food, they need to, to boil the food, which uh, helps helps our stomach so they don't get get bad stomach. Yeah. And also, they, there are some things that uh, all the other primates can eat that the that the gibbons can't. So they have to make sure that they get the, their own food, get them right ready. Okay. Hmm. Cool. One of the ways that we are able to feed all the 600 animals are through donations from the local uh, supermarkets. When they are about to throw it out, we have a deal with them that we can come and pick it up. And besides helping us feed the animals, we also help them because it's going to cost money, first of all wasting food, but it's going to cost them money to get it destroyed, all the old food. So it's a win-win situation for both, um, well, for them and us. Next up is the, all the marmosets in the tropical house that we're going to be feeding. Yeah. yeah. And I've heard we're starting at the lion-headed tamarind. Yes, we're starting with the lion-headed tamarind family in the in the terrarium. Awesome. Oh, yes, Next up, the cotton tops are getting food, and we also gonna see the lemurs being fed afterwards together with lean. All right, it's feeding time now. Yes, it is. What are we uh, feeding inside of this enclosure? Uh, we're feeding our four boys, uh, Lima boys, that's in here. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go in and put the food around and then we'll see the meat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
we are now moving over to second round in what types of food we are using to feed all of our 600 animals here at the rescue zoo. And uh, as you can see, we are, well, it's more of a protein or more, what should we call it, dry food here in this round. We have our cat food and protein powder and eggs and dog food, um, rabbit food, pellets, um, uh, parrot and peanuts and all kinds of different food. And as said, it takes a lot. First, we have the greens and we have our proteins and carbohydrates. And, you know, it's a huge variety of food that we are using to feed and nurture for our 600 animals here at the rescue zoo. And let's move over now to hear what it costs to feed our 600 animals every single month. It costs 45,000 US dollars to feed all our animals every single year here in the rescue zoo. And especially in the winter period, the six months out of the year where we, uh, you know, don't have any normal income in the normal guests in the summer period that come and visit us in the rescue zoo. The reason why we close down for the winter period is because we are located in a vacation area. So we simply wouldn't have any, you know, we wouldn't have any guests. So it would cost more to keep up the rescue zoo open basically and keep it up to the what should we call it public standard in the winter time it is harder to have you know there's no greens there's nothing you know in this nature park so it's also not as pretty you could say so and also giving us a nice and quiet time to go and prep for the next summer but when we are talking income in general it is an extremely hard period of the year where you know nobody's visiting us so we are dependent on the donations and the money we have earned in the summer period here in the rescue zoo Hi guys and welcome to the YouTube channel of the Play Rescue Livestream where we are live streaming live from the first zoo and rescue center for exotic animals in Denmark. Hope you're going to enjoy our daily adventures with all the 600 animals. It was Nico here. Take care guys. <laughs>